welcome so in this tutorial i'm going to show you or teach you on how to reset controller settings on steam using your computer so if you want to know how i did it just keep on watching so to do this you just need to follow these simple steps so first of all launch your steam right here then once you have your steam launched what you need to do is to click on the steam option at the upper left corner of your screen so once you've clicked on that you need to select settings then under settings find the controller section so once you are here so as you can see no controllers detected because i don't have any controller right now but i'm just gonna go ahead and show you the steps okay so under the external gamepad settings you need to enable the guide button focuses steam okay and leave all of the switch off or the except for this one okay so once you've done that what you need to do is to exit on steam so let me just go ahead and check it again so there so now let me just go ahead and exit on steam right here so here exit steam so now it's now shutting down the steam application so once you've done that what you need to do is to open your file explorer click on local disk c because we need to find the steam okay so once you've clicked on local disk c select the program files x86 folder and find steam so i don't have the steam folder right here so let me just go ahead and find my steam okay so let me just go ahead and find it real quick so for some reason i don't have the steam folder but let me just go ahead and dictate to you what you need to do so once you click on the program files eight i'm sorry x86 find your steam folder okay so click on the steam folder and find the config file or document okay so you should see that under the steam folder and once you've opened the config file just go ahead and press ctrl f on your keyboard and type sdl okay once you've typed sdl just go ahead and find the code where it says sdl underscore gamepad bind okay so you, sh you should see that code and after that code you should see tons of other codes okay so after the sdl underscore gamepad bind code you should delete all of that code in i think i believe that should be a one paragraph code okay so delete that one paragraph code after the sdl gamepad bind and then once you've deleted that code what you need to do is to save the file so to save the file click on the file option at the upper left corner of the tab and click or select the save option okay so once you've done that what you need to do is to launch your steam okay so once you've launched your steam again go to your settings by clicking the steam option at the upper left corner of your screen then select settings and then here select controller and select the controller that you are using so if you are using xbox controller toggle the switch on playstation controller switch pro controllers generic controllers just go ahead and toggle the switch on for the specific controller that you are using okay and then after that that should reset your controller settings on steam ok 
Okay, so I hope this video helped you and if it did, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell notification so you won't miss a video. See you on the next one and have a great day!